really, really worked on how we can bring sort of the girls who code magic to anybody, regardless of where they live and what they have access to. So the books are just another tool for more girls to find computer science and fall in love with it. something that might seem a little old school. We decided to write a book because far too many kids in our country don't have access to Wi-Fi in their schools or their homes. And this book might be their only shot at learning how to computer program. And so we are so excited and thrilled. Dennis told me that uh, every Queens resident lives within a mile of the Queens Public Library. I look around and see these amazing kids and I want all of them to be a girl who codes. You know, it's really powerful to see the books here at the library and to see the, see the kids and to know that there's millions of people who walk into here and that they're gonna get a chance to be a part of our movement. So I'm, I'm moved. So go to the person next to you, give them a high five. Give them a high five and you come forward. Proud, not only of this country, but what its future looks like. And I feel proud because of the girls in our program and what it means to own your self-worth. So I think that my point is that you don't have to look a certain way to be a software engineer, and I'm very about this cause. I've been speaking for like four years about it. I guess I just fooled myself into thinking that that was the norm. You know, there will always be more men in tech, and I will always be that girl who has to prove herself, has to even at times blend in. And as a result, I've been invited to many tech events and many hackathons, to speak at, I have won many competitions, including EmojiCon that happened like two months ago. And I know that it's the responsibility of all of us, not just women, to ensure that they do. Whenever there is an attempt to remove your voice, reclaim your time. Take the skills that you use to make sure that it improves the lives of New Yorkers and the country and the world because that's what technology is really supposed to be about. To see like so many women in tech and like they code and they're passionate about it, it's super motivating and I love it. It's just a very feel good rally and I feel empowered. I did the my summer program and it just made me a more confident, more curious and more passionate person, especially when it came to coding and women in tech. So we are at a dangerous time, I think, in terms of what the economic potential is for our girls if we don't start changing our messages and be very intentional about what we're pushing our girls to do. I'm just so proud. We just finished a year of Girls with Code at her school and I've just seen her you know, work through her projects and it's, it's just been wonderful.